think that's it. You know, what is going to happen next? We've seen the uh, the two extremes, haven't we? Me, so I'm dominating the second and uh, oh, we're nearly the first. So hopefully they're going to meet in the middle and we're going to have an unbelievable third. Let's hope so. One game all. Serve to serve. Level. So we've got the third game. Very eagerly anticipated between these two, the last semi final of this World Championship for the ladies. Lovely. That's the hold. Hand out, one low. Hand out, one all. Down. One. Oh, she's on the <laughs> run. She was. She was doing court sprints. Pejev and out to across all. the middle of the court. There, couldn't quite get it back. So early. This is ridiculous quality. It is. I mean, it is. Tempo is very, very high, but it's the accuracy at that tempo that's so impressive. The variety that's going on, all four corners being explored. And, uh, Oh, wow. Oh, uh, I mean, she just looks awesome. I mean, physically so, so strong. Both of them in that rally. Awesome display of women's squash. She's getting tough now physically. No. Had a feeling she'd go for that. You could, I could feel Four it coming. Two. She loves that little drop off the sidewall return of serve. Doesn't always go for the nick. She's very good at the one that just fades second bounce into the sidewall. Can also play it into the nick as well. Well lifted, clever shot by Sam. Even cleverer shot there by <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh she's had a shocker. Dear. She's had a shocker. That That's the type of shot that Willili plays so well. The uh, yeah. hold and then the chop board. cross court. It was almost so bad, it was brilliant. Oh dear. Oh wow. <laughs> Uh, looks like a, uh, a PSA squash TV crew shot. <laughs> That's quite amazing. Look at that, and then she hits that. She 
really does uh, use a body weight to hit down as well as the racket face on that backhand side. So does this volley touch? really, I mean, it's just lethal. I mean, you can see that she's been fed so many hours, thousands Five, of hours three. on that side, but it wouldn't be as effective on the on the higher tin, but uh, no. what a shot to play on the glass court lower tin. Yeah, it's her favorite area. Racket's almost already out there prepared. It's better from Raneem, working it across the body of Camille into the forehand. No left. Hand out for five. Well, it's one all, five all, Jen. Nothing in it. <laughs> oh, Quality of squash for both these ladies. Semi finals has been uh, right up there. Six Fantastic five. to see. I do like it when I see this kind of reaction from Raneem. Yeah, it was, she had the same attitude against Mazzaro in the last round. Just pushed her on a bit and enabled her to stretch out. Needs to get a bit of daylight here. Brilliant from the Egyptian. Seven five. Makes it look so simple, the game of squash sometimes. Just stayed in. Oh, that's oh. clever. That's a clever angle on the volley. She knew exactly six, where the ball seven. wanted to go. She wasn't going to go for the cross court, Nick. Running it slightly higher above the tin, but nice and acute into the sidewall. Both girls now playing some of their best squash. Really good to watch. Down. Seven all. Chatting away to herself, yalla yalla. Um. Hang on a minute. What was just, that? I don't think Camille Serms was down. I think he Sorry? caught Camille Serms. No, I called but your ball down on the front wall. <laughs> Raneem advising her opponent to review it. <laughs> yeah, it was up. I thought that ball was up. Yeah, it was. It was a bit of an early call there by Marco. Eight, seven. A bit Hang excited, the ref there. Oh, there's no review on that, just no, on pick up. No, no, that was up, Jen, that was up. There needs to be a bit of communication, possibly. There needs to be we communication. Can only the pick up. Play let, please. Ball was up. Play so let, having a let ball. Got Seven there in the end, Jerry. It was up. Just thinking of Raneem talking to herself a little bit. I remember when uh, Rami first came on the scene, and I, I always thought Rami and Raneem were quite uh, similar to each other, both so gifted, but always have the little chats in their head. Yeah. Oh, 
He's done so well, Camille Sir, but one shot too far. Another shout out from El Walili. And out, 8 7. Just sneaking at 8 7. Crucial third game. Crucial. Be a big cheer from the crowd if Walili can somehow get this point. Found the nick. Slightly fortuitous. Out. And out, eight, nine. Ball was out, definitely. So the uh, referee spotting the out of court. Just a one point lead. It's well recovered. Good height used by the French number one. Oh, and then the wow. snap of the volley, that was awesome. Defence and attack. So good, that. Ball. What it's a my pattern. my legs shaking. She took that so far out in front as well. Lethal. Really leap forward. One all, nine all. Short to serve. Well, she's going to go for... A review. Player Just review of Lily on the stroke decision. Original decision being a stroke. I don't think that's going to be overturned, Jen. No. Totally in a swing there, unfortunately, for the Egyptian. Can't see this being anything other than a stroke. Stroke to serve, decision upheld. Well, Lily has no reviews remaining. 10 9, game ball. So, game ball for the number two seed, Kimi Sir, for a 2 1 lead. And she's got the width. <laughs> now we're into the nail biting tie break. This Hand is out. getting exciting, Jerry. A player must win by two points. Each player has Just one what review. the crowd available. wanted. As long as it ends with an Egyptian win for them. <laughs> but a uh, superb game, this third game. And butter shots for Kamisa. Thundered 11, it 10. halfway down the Game tin. Ball. Mistimed it. It was loose. It was on a racket. She's been sorting those volleys on forehand and backhand throughout the whole of this third game. I'm not sure that would have happened at one all in this game. So, game ball once again for Willili. the lob. It's a lovely way to stroke from Walili. It's nice Great. hold yeah. on that forehand side. Caresses the ball on a forehand. Pitch perfect, four hand volley, one of the biggest four hand volleys she's had to play. Certainly the biggest in this event so far from Willili. Classic match unfolding, 34 minutes, Willili leads two games to one.